and good evening. Welcome to Wicked Dilly's Let's Play Circus with me, Dilly. Today I'll be playing Kohan 2, Kings of War. And I'll be playing, um, uh, this will be a solo Let's Play, my first solo Let's Play. But I'm already active in, uh, in the Let's Play group, Wicked Dilly's Let's Play Circus. We've got a channel with lots of other fun things. It's, uh, it's something you might want to check out. It's uh, lots of fun. Uh, anyway, I will, play, I will be playing Kohan 2, Kings of War. It's a 2004 uh, Timegate Studio R RTS. It's, um, it, it differs a little from most RTSs in ways that you'll uh, soon find out. Uh, Timegate Studios is an American studio, I think. I'm not quite sure. At least the, the brilliant minds behind such fantastic games as Fear, Extraction Point, and Fear, Pursuit, Mandate, and Section 8, and... Axis vs. Allies and lots of other stuff you've never heard about. And of course the Cohen series, which is underrated, but a lot of fun. We'll be playing the campaign. Yes, oh yes we will. And we shall start with the boring intro video. Now I'm going to have to warn you, uh, yeah you can read this blah blah blah. I'm going to have to warn you, um, gameplay in this game is very good. The story is very bad. Characters, setting and everything voice acting, it's a bit saddening. So, here's my voiceover. Oh the crap, evil city of evil, with gravity defying dragons, an emo wizard looking out over a skeleton army, and a lot of dead people who aren't skeletons. And we've got some evil dead trees, and evil dead rocks, and some fossils. No one knows what the fossils are doing here, and catapults and stuff. And there is Darius, champion of Kohan 1. This protagonist is immortal, like all Kohan. Like, they die, but then they come back, but without memory. But apparently, with a giant army of, of golden knights, and, and three links on horses. You see, you see those horses? Link is on the horses, all of them. And there he goes, Darius, off to the evil city of evil. And there's a chick running behind him, but kind of has to, like, eh, you, you go ahead! And the soldier guy's like, no, I got all I got all day. You, you just, you, yeah, we'll, we'll follow up ahead. And we're off with lightning, which doesn't affect him. He's like, oh, lightning, I don't care. I'm fucking Darius, I don't care about lightning. And here comes all the confusing lights everywhere and, and a meteor strike because it's Final Fantasy VII. And as you can see, it's a naughty opinion on the right flank. And blackness. And the city falls down. It's down. It's down. And Darius confronts the emo wizard, which does an evil death, death, then staff, and bah! Yeah, you see, Darius brought a sword. Eve, evil dances of death magic on a magic sword. And now Darius appears to be obsessed with the building and glows red and then stops glowing red. And he just ignores meteor strikes and, and chill dragons behind him. And the soldier guys are like, oh, this is nice, I can live here. Anyway, this was probably some kind of reminder of, of conflict in Cohen 1, because Cohen 1 was basically like, uh, we are light, oh, there's darkness, oh, let's just, let's kill it, and they did, and fun. And now everything is well, in the world of Cohen 2. With trees, and some burnt trees, no one knows where the birds, and goatsies! Yay! Or, or other goat-like animals. I don't know, I love all of them, even the double unicorn. Oh, oh, oh. This is my there is no light. rest for those who cannot die. <gasps> Even with the defeat of the Dark Lord Arima oh, yeah. and the scattering of his servants, the Sia, the drums of war still beat. Soft Softer now, now but, but growing. growing. Whispers of war have reached Sophia Fairfax, regent of Hysteria. An unknown force is attacking the borderlands, who sacking towns, be? burning outposts, and taking her people. Taking her people. Ever vigilant, the Stand regent has dispatched Stand her finest seeker to investigate these attacks. For if, as the regent suspects, a resurgent Sia is behind Not these attacks, that. this could herald the dawn of a new, new war. war. So yeah, story thus far, uh, we have Koan 1. Yeah, the Sia are beaten and Arimon is dead! And now the start of Koan 2. Oh, they might not be. Let's find out. In mission one, the Borderlands. 
Reports of raids and attacks on the steel borderlands have prompted the dispatch of Nava Dushrims from Barbar. Nava, who is a seeker, has been sent in to investigate the attacks. Whoop! Horsey is going through trees! And there's people on, from the Green Army on horses, just chilling with dead bodies and looking at a building. Who goes there? I am a seeker dispatched by Sophia Fairfax, oh, yeah. region of Estira. What oh, has happened, happened here? here? Disaster, milady. Our homes have been razed, our crops oh, burnt, and, and our livestock slaughtered. This is, this is magnificent. The enemy lays siege to Shadan even You have, you have hammer guys. You have Lord like Galen is trapped buildings within. are on fire, but they could fix it by beating it with hammers. Jadan Just like besieged? in the real world. Ready yourselves. We ride, we ride to Jadan. To Shadan. And ride we shall with my two awesome cavalry companies, Company <laughs> One and Company Ready Two. Combat formation. Let's go. Yeah, that's that's a bit of a disappointing thing in Kohan Two. That Kohan One actually looks a little better in Kohan Two in that Kohan One featured very nice 2D art, or at least it, it was better looking than this. They decided to go 3D. And well, on the other hand, it is a 2004 game. So. But yeah, I don't know. anyway, I, I like I like the style Cohen One more. Um, I have played Cohen One and Two. Um, I don't think I finished One. I did finish Two, but it's quite some years ago. It's um, I sort of rediscovered Cohen Two. My father's magical the attic with, with magical Saja, history. It's, it's always fun in my dad's attic. You can just stroll around in my, my personal history and find Saja, fun things. Games that were not, never really well known. Um, also, Saja, a little explanatory point. Uh, these companies, they heal up automatically as long as you're in uh, green zone area stuff. Saja, light our way. I like how no one cleans up these corpses. For the light. Okay. My thanks, Nava. Your aid Fine. comes when we need it most. But I fear our troubles have only just begun. For the light. Your mother has only just begun. Alright, we've got some additional companies and For the light. we're being sacked from the right. Basically in this mission all we do is, uh, yeah, For the light. just defend this town, city, For my people. from generic Human, yeah, human invaders. They, they, they're called CR, uh, but clearly humans. A deer. Uh, and now this is this is the nice thing about Kohan. You have this entirely ar entire army fighting and stuff, but they do all the work, and I can just I can have them flee, um, or they'll flee automatically when they're like, oh, poopy pants. But uh, yeah, it's. Let's do it. Oh, and, Ooh. Ooh. and now, way. as you can see here, this guy fled uh, because he was almost annihilated. And we've seen that companies can recover, but when all of the units in the company die, then the company is gone. And ready so, to money. so that's really something you want to avoid. Steady you want to keep now. your company fighting for as long as you can because, well, the more it's fighting, the more effective it is. But you don't the want it to be completely eradicated because, yeah, that's just, that's just really a waste. So that's that's really the balance the in Koan. You have to know all. when to retreat and and how, more or less. And I like it how... Oh, all right. You're what is it, my liege? Well, these guys can recover here. Oh, Attention. there's only one company here. What that's is it, my not liege? very favorable. In fact, you just uh, the creator watches this us way. all. Zaja, light our way. And Ready to ride. What is here. it, my liege? You can help out here. You can heal up for a second and be at once, sir. And um, you guys, I'm going to assign you a new captain. This is generic captain. Hello, generic captain. How are you doing today? On our way. Yes, you're on your way. No, no, you're not. I'm going to sack you and replace you with at this guy. At once, sir. This is a Kohan. He's a special champion. He has some abilities, and he um, he levels, and he gets more abilities as he levels. But um, as mentioned, 
Kohan are immortal, but when they die, they do come back, but they've lost a lot of memories, including experience. So that's also something uh, you want to avoid. Alright, and now we wait for the next attack. Uh, and you guys can just do some tracks around the city. I'm going to expand the city. As you can see, I've got two expansion slots. I want some more stone going, and I want some more wood going. So there, there we have it. And these magnificent hammer guys, they just pound the ground and buildings erect magically like they do in most games. Uh, let's see, it's four companies. Awaiting your power. Back to your seats. This side. Um, well, I'm, uh, I'm Dilly from the Wicked Dilly Let's Play Circus. We're a group of five friends from Netherlands. Um, beside me we have Wicked, who is pretty good at games and pretty good at being a bit of a dickhead. But, but we all, but we're all okay with that. And um, he's playing uh, Wario Land. Or yeah, at least uh, some of the time he's playing Wario Land. Um, we have the lovely, lovely Sona. She's she's a girl. She's an actual girl. And um, she she has quite some experience in uh, in gaming as well. Though of course she's not as good as as, as me or. But she still, she's, she's, she tries. I'm, I'm sorry, Sona. I, I know you try. So, Sona, Sona, don't, don't fire me, Sona. Sona, I love you. I love you, Sona. I'm sorry. Anyway, she's, um, Where she has a lot of uh, fun things going on with her uh, dust box games because, your like me, she, uh, she's I pretty much into uh, playing old games. And, um, Zaja, well, up way. until shortly, the three of us were playing, uh, were involved in uh, a German game called Clonk Rage, which, which is a really silly and really fun game. It's, um, at the Saturday moment, there, there are some Ready difficulties with, with Clonk, and, um, we're not really sure if we're going to Let's ride. Uh, continue uh, uh, the way it is. But anyway, we still, we already have lots of videos, and it's worth watching because it's, uh, it's a lot of fun and lots of silliness so that's uh, that's that's really something you want to check out um, furthermore on the team we have the wonderful ingenious Mr. J from Wiki Let's Play Circus he's um, he only recently discontinued his uh, Earthbound series but he's still uh, he can still be seen in um, uh, in Dishonored, which uh, which he uh, which is a lot of fun. He, he plays Dishonored with done. our fifth and final member Zepep, which is uh, the only person who is actually involved in a circus in real life, which is which is a lot of fun. Let's go, uh, ready to ride. Duck faced here. So this is not good. And that's one company dead. What is it, my this is not going Let's well. Do it. This one will. This one better. Uh, yeah, right. Yes, my lord. Anyway, this is uh, my first solo let's play, and um, I'm having fun up to now. I'm just watching these guys beat fire with with hammers. Nice stuff. I serve the light. And um, what is it, my liege? Oh, I think I uh, I might have to clip here for a moment. And I guess I'll be seeing you in the next part. <laughs>